Hi everybody, I'm Shinted Moon. Welcome to my channel. I got my first witchy unboxing. Came like this. I just opened the box with a scissor just to try to get it loose. Um, my first box for January 2024. It came from Sacred Space Crate. So I'm so excited to see what the new year is going to bring. Last year ended with beautiful boxes as well. So I'm looking forward to all the many, many months of beautiful boxes to come. All right, so first off, the theme is Witch's Brew. Very cool theme for, for sure, for January. Witch's Brew. We'll go over that last. Ooh. Our calendar is very pretty. Little teapot there. And very colorful. And the back always has the zodiac. All right, so today's date is Wednesday, January 3rd. And it's the last quarter moon at 9.30 p.m. So we still have time for the last quarter to come. And then we're going to go into the new moon, which lands on January 11th. So it's a perfect time for magic on um, taking things away. And then this is what it looks like. We've got green paper and that sticker. The sticker says, I solemnly swear that I'll make the most of this year magical. I say, it says, I solemnly swear that I'll make this, I'll make the most of this magical year. Sorry, guys. Need to get my glasses upgraded. Again, this is what it looks like when I open it. So the first thing we got is vanilla bean incense sticks. Vanilla bean. I'm just getting over COVID again for like the fourth time. I'm just tired of getting COVID. Mmm, that smells good. Vanilla is always a lovely scent. And then we have a yellow color beeswax candle here it smells good too all right gonna dig on the side because there's a big item there we'll save that for last which is brew ritual tea very pretty it has a nice label And then we also have Witch's Brew Mulling Spices. Orange peel, cinnamon, clove, and allspice. Nice, thick size bag. You kind of can see some of the herbs in there. All right. We have a lip balm called Lemon Tree. Lemon Tree Lip Balm. What else we got going on here? <clears throat> Excuse me. We got a bubbled item here. Um, let's see. It's Witch's Brew Potion. Lavender Tea Drops. Ooh. This is really pretty color, too. You see the purple? That's really nice. Put that in your tea. Ooh. Interesting. And then we have rose tea drops. Another pretty color. Nice. I guess I'm kind of knowing what's in that uh, special box down there. Then we got our bubble item. This is going to be our herb, I believe. Ooh, and our herb is lemon sugar. Lemon sugar. Really pretty. You can see bits of lemon in there. Cute. I think we know what we're going with this, guys. <laughs> this is such a great, great box. I've never got, like, 
box with these cool drops. That's really interesting. We got this pretty green sachet here. And in here we have a beautiful golden heart tea ball. And we have on top a little potion bottle vial. So that's really cute. Yes, you can put whatever you want in the potion vial. And then we have this box. And that's everything in the box, right? Oh, no, it's not. We also have this. All right. All right. So before I open the main big item here, there is this one little item here. So it's in a pink bag, and it's really pretty heart. Ooh, it looks like strawberry quartz heart. Really, really pretty. Jemmy heart. Cute. I'm dying to see what's in our box here. It's taped, so I'm going to need a scissor or something to get that open. Okay. Ooh. Look at that. I don't want it to break, so I'm going to pull it out nice and gentle. Wow, this is fabulous. Really fabulous. Look at this. Beautiful glass teacup. And it's got blue flower, gold, green, more flowers. Beautiful fairy right here on the glass. More flowers. And look at the beautiful handle big blue flower there. This is gorgeous. And it's nice weight. Wow, that is beautiful. I've never seen anything like that. Wow. And it also comes with a spoon. Silver spoon here with a gold tip with the blue rose. That is absolutely stunning. I'm blown away on the beauty. I love this. I really love this. Wow. Keeping that safe until my kitchen's finished. Because my rooms are not done yet. All right. Let's see. This is so far, January. First box. I love it. For thousands of years, witches, young and old, have concorded mysterious potions to heal, to divine the future, to get into touch with the energies of the planet, to create magic. The fun, the most fun part of my practice is making witches brew potions for magical purposes. Tea is one of the most magical ways for spell casting because it is taken internally and easily draws your attention with its smells and tastes. Tea contents. Tea connects you to the earth with its magical powers and plants. Of plants, sorry. My intention with this box was to give you several tools for your potion brewing and tea rituals. The items in this box is as follows. This gorgeous glass teacup and matching teaspoon. I really wanted to find a beautiful ritual tea and potion drinking cup that I fell in love with this one. I love the clear glass cup with the gold painted and blue roses and the butterfly make it magical and earthy. The glass teacup comes with matching teaspoon to use as your wand when stirring your spell or potions. The spoon is adorned with the same blue rose and rhinestone finishes on the teacup. Love it. Gold heart tea, gold heart tea ball and potion bottle. The gold tea ball is adorable as a heart-shaped tea ball. Attached to the tea ball is a small potion bottle for your lavender or rose tea drops included in this box. Simply drop your potion into the bottle with your dropper and cork it closed. Add it to your tea as a ritual. And then, Witch's Brew Potion Lavender. 
this baby here. Delicious lavender potion for your tea rituals. Lavender generally used in divination rituals, peace, love, protection, sleep, purification, and happiness spells. Dropping this potion into your cup will lift your spirits to ease your mind. Great for meditation practices, grounding, posting rituals. Which is brew potion rose. Oh, yeah, rose. This rose potion is deliciously in your tea as well as it brings taste to energy and love and beauty. Use in love, beauty, attraction, self-love, good luck, and compassion spells. Lemon sugar in a glass or jar. Lemon sig signals as a time of for purpose, action, and clarity. Clear-headed decisions will help you focus, bringing your dreams closer to reality. Sugar is known for its magnet energy that can attract both material and spiritual abundance. And this lemon sugar made with organic cane sugar and organic lemon peel to your witchy spell potions and enjoy a cup of tea. Witches brew ritual tea. That is this baby here. Ritual tea is a staple in a lot of our practice with magical brews. Witches brew ritual tea enhances your mind, memory, third eye, and focus. It improves your mood. The tea is a mixture of peppermint leaves, gota cola, Lemongrass, ginkgo, marigold, petals, urethro, licorice, diamond, and husha. One teaspoon of this tea and eight ounces of boil, boiling water. Let's see for four minutes. And according to taste, per your ritual instructions. Then your mowing spices. Mowing spices, all spices for success, cinnamon for good luck and attraction dried orange peel for health, success, and happiness, and clothes for protection, love, money, and healing. Um, again, you can add this to wine or apple cider drinks as well. Two tablespoons of this blend into a muslin bag, tea strainer, half a gallon of cider or to wine and simmer for an hour, hour and a half, or simmer in water over your stovetop to fill the room with magical and delicious fragrance. So you can also use it as a um, stovetop blend. Strawberry quartz, beautiful little heart here. Metaphysics process include healing. It helps resolve past traumas and release, relieves emotional blockages, aligns with the earth, fire, storm, spirit, resonates with grounding. Stability, passionate, creativity, transformative change, and spiritual enlightenment. The crystal was carved into a heart shaped. Then the natural beeswax candle. Candles are considered purity and light. Many spiritual traditions and their use can help honor deities or create atmosphere for meditation and spell casting. This benefits a beeswax is a longer burn time, environmental friendliness, neutralizes odor in your home, excuse me, <coughs> zero chemical compounds, pure beeswax candle. Lemon tree lip balm. Delicious tasting and smelling lip balm to soothe your chap lips made with natural ingredients. She always makes a nice, beautiful handmade product. And then vanilla bean incense sticks, a warm, Fragrant, a warm fragrance with rich notes of vanilla bean, aged whiskey, and toasted sugar cane. This incense is perfect for tea time. <clears throat> Excuse me. Incense fragrance. And vanilla is a symbol of purity and sensuality. It also represents happiness, comfort, and contentment. And of course, our beautiful calendar for January. My first box again. I love it. This cup. This beautiful teacup and spoon is absolutely beautiful. That might be the most beautiful teacup I've gotten. It's just very enchanting and very like, I don't know, to me, magical. I love it. So let me know guys what you think of the first box from Sacred Space Crate. I'll leave the information down below guys. And let me see if it gives you a hint for next month's. Ooh. Next month's theme for February is African magic. That is very cool. A lot of, it's always good to learn different backgrounds of magic. Always love that. So I can't wait to see what she 
puts together for the African magic. Thank you guys for watching and have a blessed new year.